Need five of these in uh, Windy Hill, but screw it. Let's go. Let's go into Desert Ruins. Desert Ruins Zone 1. These animals are quite underwhelming. I'm disappointed in you incompetent fools. Finally disappointed. I love that line really. <laughs> That's awesome. Disappointment, master. Ooh, you're being a bit uh you care now? All hail the magic can't. Yeah, so apparently this is what he's using to control the the um, Zeti, as they're known. That's their race, and the Zeti. They're being controlled via a musical instrument. Okay, whatever. Yay, desert ruins. We're in the desert. Let's get going. Yay. Love doing that. Fuck you. Up we go. And away. And away. Up we go. First red ring. Right, let's see. Can I jump up here? Let's try up here. So, yeah, let's uh, talk a little bit about... Um... The desert world and see. It did get a fair bit of criticism actually for being a bit too, um. Shall we say, uh, being a bit too, uh, Mario? Damn it. Don't, oh god. A uh, bit too Mario in like that it had like the um, grassy world and then the desert world and then uh, you know and so on and so forth. It pretty much uses all the um, stereotypical um, uh, Super Mario Brother, new Super Mario Brothers tropes, and you have wall jumping. Ah, Tom, what are you doing, lad? Let's go. Don't jump. Don't let them get you, otherwise it's an instant kill. Fuck it. Let's go this way. If they, uh, if you go into their mouths, then that's an instant kill. Let's go this way. Slow platforming. This is a pretty much a staple of a. Uh, Sonic since the classic days. Kind of the slower programming. The slower platforming. Yeah, you need to be remarkably quick with those. Yeah, I don't really care about red rings, like I said. And we get out of there. Uh, in terms of the aesthetic of uh, this level, one thing I will say is that I like it when the levels become a bit more open, like this, when they're not using the... Oh, there's nothing there. Fuck. Like when they're not using the... Um... Yeah, those things are annoying, you have to kill them straight away. Come on, Heron Attack. Activate for me. There we go. Um, that's bullshit. Let's get that. Didn't get the extra life. Fuck. Let's get going. Keep moving. Those things will hurt you. Destroy them. Yeah, so destroy them before your fire hits you and you'll be fine. Up we go. So, uh, in terms of the overall aesthetic and how this game kind of looks, how this level looks, I'll be honest, 
I find it all a bit. I find the aesthetic a little bit um boring to be honest, but I find it all a bit dull, but whatever. I've certainly played a worse um, level than Sonic. So it's not absolutely abysmal, it's just a little bit dull in terms of how Ooh! Just in terms of how it looks really. Get going. Shit, that was stupid. I don't know what happened there. I guess I was just uh, holding the sprint button a bit too much, ironically. But you know, it's Sonic, gotta go fast. Okay, let's go on. Shit, I'm in trouble. Oh, just about. Fucking hell. <laughs> I was cutting it, cutting it tight there. Fuck it, let's go. And we're out. Uh, yeah. This world is a little bit... Apart from one area, I, apart from one act, I think it's a little bit dull. But I'm not going to complain too much early on, because, um... Overall, the level design is pretty open. It looks. Uh, overall, the level design is pretty open. It does some. And it gives it something a little bit different in terms of what kind of platforming you have to do. As compared to the first level, so. Not going to complain a great deal. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> Let's get going. Screw you. Right. And I do like these little um Fuck it. Let's get going. And away we go. Where did that come from? Oh you, you prick. <laughs> I hear you. I could see that coming a mile off, but nothing I can do about it. Whoops. There we go. And that's the end of Desert Ruins Zone 1. Which is kind of uh, interesting. That, um. Yeah, that's something actually. The, um. Usually, um. Sonic games usually uh, call the, um. The worlds, if you like. They call them zones. And then they call the actual levels acts. But in this case, it's the. You know, they call it worlds and zones, which is a little bit weird, but whatever. I'm not going to complain too much about that. He's watching an LP in the background, isn't that nice? Meet Zomom! He's a fat bastard. <laughs> Look at him. Look at that fat fucker. Oh boy! <laughs> I love that. And that's where I mean these. Shut up, phone. These things are pretty much. These guys are pretty much stereotypes. Zaz is the uh, moron. <laughs> and uh, Zomom is the uh, fat idiot. And you know. Uh, and what does the Zomom like to do? Well, he's obsessed with eating shit. go. So yeah, this is a well, this is a new uh, design, a new level uh, type as well, which I kind of like actually. Uh, basically, like the um, max speed sections in uh, in uh, Sonic 6, except you know they control well. And I like these little home and attack chains of these um, chains of these bugs. They're fun. Let's get an extra life. Yay, and down we go. Let's 
managed to speed through. Ha <laughs> ha, you didn't touch me. I got another extra life, yay. I'm up to 19. 19, and I've only played through... How many levels? Uh, I guess this this is level number 6. Shit, man. You really do wreck up. Thank God I wreck up the lives quickly. <sighs> Alright. That was me kind of being a bit too... At least I'm not too far back. I'm hardly any... Yeah. Let's go this way. A few extra lives there. Always appreciated. There we go. Let's jump straight across. And he shoots me off. Red ring. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that was pathetic. Okay, okay, I'm dying a bit too often now. Okay, here we go. Made it through. And now it's time for our first ba battle with Zomon. And we're on a weird looking face. This is one of the more bizarre things. Yeah. Avoid it. Yeah, so he jumps up. And basically you just have to wait for him to land. Charge up the heaven attack and... And we wait. For some reason he shrinks and he's got like a weird... This thing shrinks and it's got like a screaming face. It's kind of weird. Oh well. Which way are you going to go? Oh shit. He does it twice now. Oh my god he's a rebel. <laughs> and now we just have to wait. Fuck you. You're dead. I kicked your ass. <sighs> Man, that was way too easy. <laughs> and that's the end of Desert Ruins Zone 2. Which, by the way, I will say this. It's kind of weird. Because even though it got a bit of stick for kind of going for the more traditional theme, Mario's themes, if you like, of like having... Um, like... Uh, like... Uh, green, followed by desert, followed by... Um, uh, followed by uh, tropical settings and all that kind of shit. Um, even though it gets a lot of shit for that. Um, Desert Ruins? We have we have had the first one which was a desert level. The second one we just went through which was more of a kind of um, running along trees really. Um, and then the third one is going to be different, and then the fourth one we get back to a desert setting. So actually it's... I can't give it too much shit for that kind of thing. Because of the fact that it actually... Even though the world map is kind of makes it look that way, the levels kind of... Um, kind of... At least in this world anyway, they kind of mix and match. See what I mean?